In this lesson, we're going to combine the recalls that we've been working with with the front platform that we introduced in the last lesson. I'm going to start by asking for just a very short recall, keeping the distance short so that my dog can't get up too much speed uh, because it's easier to control a nice sit in front if you're not going very fast than if you're going much more quickly. Um, and this is definitely a dog who will build up speed as she runs towards me. So we're going to start with just a couple of feet away. I have left her to stay. If your dog isn't quite there yet, you can have a helper hold them, um, or you could leave them on a platform at the other end as well. I'm standing so that I'm nice and straight to my platform. I've actually got my toes tucked under it just a little bit. Um, and my dog is pretty straight on, so I'm really setting her up for this to be as easy as possible in the beginning. Oh, front! Good, and she's nice and straight because the platform is helping her. She is aware of which side the cookies are on, so I'm going to compensate for that by feeding from the other side. Quick, go get it. Oh, front! Good. And then we just went back into another round of our get it and front game that we did last week. Um, as your dog gets better at this, you can start adding more and more distance. Realize that the faster they're going, the harder it will be to skid into a nice straight front, but the platform really helps them to not be wrong um, so it's really good for building up muscle memory and just creating the habit of coming in nice and straight to do lots of recalls with your platform. Before we fade the platform out, you want to be adding a lot of distance and possibly even having them a little bit offset so they really have to think about how to come in straight. 